with an up day. Jeff's here with his low bed. Snowcat's ready to go. Nice machine. So, big shout out to Jeff, who uh, it's his truck and, and low bed that we're moving the cat because my gooseneck, which is over there, is great, but uh, I don't have a truck to pull it with with a gooseneck. And the snow cat is 10 feet wide, so you do need permits for overwit, which Jeff obviously has. And I don't, I just kind of don't get them when I move things, but uh, this is the right way to do it. So big shout out to Jeff, super last minute, but making it work. Dropping the trailer, then he'll pull away with the front piece still attached to the truck. Pretty slick. he's going to load his uh, big ranger over the back and take him up at the same time. Today we are heading up to the Thunder Mountain drag strip for a bit of an off-road day. It's kind of a open invite for people to come off-roading and then the, the big dogs, uh, big snow wheelers will be doing some drag racing later on. So we're gonna go catch the action and maybe do some snow catting, maybe do some jeeping. Who knows? We'll see you there. Okay, figure out where my snow cat is. All right all signed in so we'll go check out the area i actually haven't well i've been up here many many years ago to this area but it's been a while so go check it out could not ask for a better day it's currently minus six degrees celsius not a cloud in the sky and this time in february can be pretty nasty so this is awesome all the big dogs. Devin's rig. Wanna be Marge? Nice. What's up, fellas? Yeah, to... Putting chains on? Get the chains on. Hell yeah, buddy. Joel's rig. Tacoma. Nice. We're oh, just out kind of checking out the area. It was minus 25 last night, so there isn't much snow, but the snow that is here is actually really bad quality because it's just dry, sugary junk. But um, yeah, we're gonna wait a little bit before we get too crazy, but Denny's having a little play. Oh, there's Devin and his buggy. I have a feeling this video is going to be very uh, sporadic. There's going to be a lot of things going on at random times, but I'll capture what I can.
wheel drive. Whoops. This is looking good. Yeah, thank you. Good day for it too. Yeah, man. Have you guys tried any of the trails at the bottom there? No, just showed up. So yeah, hell yeah. Go check them out. Stoked. They're pretty rad. Truck's running good? Yeah, other than the diff just broke. That'll happen on the big jobs. <laughs> People are starting to flow in pretty good. Um, so we're gonna go up and see what kind of action we can capture before the racing starts. But drag racing in like uh, uh, 45 minutes or so and should be pretty good. Many people's favorite rig, that one. It is a good looking truck. is a pit over here. Wow. Jared's giving it a shot. like just the wrong width for the old axles and tires. It's 
Going. Going. Oh, he'll get that. He'll get that for sure. There it is. Nice. Hopefully the camera does justice. It's deep. Here's the guys that are going to be racing. All shapes and sizes today. I like the paddles. I'm excited to see how those do. Doing a bit of a driver's meeting. And then I think we'll get the races started. Just having a coffee. Having a coffee, <laughs> yeah. For sure, just a coffee. These are the racing lanes. You can go on the sides here or the mud pits, which are down there. So we might only see the top half of the rig, but be able to cap catch some action anyways. Well, looks like they're just lining up, uh, getting ready. So some races should be underway pretty quick here. All right, they're lining up and it looks like they're using the outside lanes here, not in the mud pit. I don't know if they will eventually, but outside for now so the view will be better so jared's lining up against levi see what happens jared by about a half a city block that's good first race done next race couple jeeps i think it's a uh, guy from chilliwack racing against his wife next up a couple little buggies i don't even know what this thing is but it's adorable and that's like a ultra four style car The cute little buggy takes it. Good race, actually. I might move a little closer to the finish line, give some finish line action. Husband and wife race again. She's gonna take them. <laughs> Love it. She's been ripping around today, having a good time. Love to see it. All right. Devin and Jared. This should be a good race. Jared takes them. Couple of beast vehicles. Okay, got a little bit of hearing loss on that one. The old Ford against the Mazda. Oh, bad spin. Jeff gets him though. Luke's first run. Uh, Cummins Diesel in his rig. Jared gets him. The old Diesel's a good torque machine, but not so much for the drag race. This old school, uh, whatever it is, flat deck against Levi. I don't even know who won that one. Photo finish. Nice. Joel's first time out here. Little bit late, he got taken. Man, there's been a 
couple pretty close races. Luke got him. Jared's up. That was a good one. He was moving on that run. Got a little western at the end there. Got his front tire into some of the powder. Turned him sideways a bit. Buggy against the old Ford. putting on a show. Hopefully that smoke is nothing too bad. All right, this is gonna be a good race. Jared against Joel. Woo -hoo -hoo. I'll have to play that one back. Jared and Joel running it back. Joel in the near lane this time. Joel got him this time. Broke through the ice. <laughs> Looks pretty deep. show giving the people what they want
just when I thought the event was over, it's just half time. So there's some pretty nasty ruts. So we're hopping in the old dozer to go groom the, the big ruts. Really smooth. As you can tell, two nasty ruts. They've pushed back all this dirt. This is a mound built up like two feet. So we'll push that back in. Hopefully make it a little more even. That's great. That was a lot.
say that is gonna do it for today. Um, hopefully, I don't know what I got. It's uh, definitely mayhem, as you can imagine at an event like this, but hopefully I got some footage that you enjoyed. So thanks very much for watching. Subscribe if you haven't, and we'll catch you next time, which is hopefully gonna be a snowcat adventure, because it's running good. <laughs>